slide two, the introduction, pages one to four. Item one, the rationale. The justification for knowledge in this area is because facial anomalies are frequent conditions in children every part of the world. If these anomalies are not treated appropriately and adequately, there will be imposition of severe psychosocial problems on the parents of such children. And the appropriateness and adequacy of the definitive treatment, which is often surgery, lie in the proper understanding of the anatomic and embryologic basis of these anomalies. You will therefore agree with me that this lecture is very important to the practice of oral maxillofacial surgery. Methodology. Each animated outline in the slides to be projected for the lecture will come before its audio, and the outlines will be made to be as representative as possible of what are in their respective audios. There will be terms and phrases that will be emboldened in the PowerPoint slides and the full text, and students will be expected to search for the details from the Internet. This is meant to encourage students' participation in the learning process as well as making the process electronically interactive through intranet. The clinical aspects of basic oral sciences will be taught at 500 and 600 levels, while at the same time integrating it with the basic concepts. For example, the embryology of the face will be revisited when clinical aspects of facial anomalies are taught. The delivery process. The delivery process will be by means of audio enhanced lectures, tutorials, video clips on clinical demonstrations, as well as video clips on surgeries. All the teaching materials will be made available in form of OER and in my website www.profacquandedenta.com. They will also be downloaded into CD for the students to replay many times. In order to meet the needs of all students, Two formats of downloading will be deployed. The format that can be replayed using PC and that that can be replayed using household devices. Item 4. The vision and mission of the school. The methods as described above is the approach that will be used to deliver all the lectures, clinical demonstrations and hands-on teachings in this school. Bearing in mind the school's vision which is to the point to offer a sort of teaching and learning processes that will ensure that every student passes the school's examination at all levels of 400 to 600 level and mission to be the most clearly far dental school in Africa based on the school's contemporary pedagogic concept which will be premised on the acronym S student oriented, P problem solving, I integrated, C community based, E evidence based, S systematic.